right? Looks a bigger pile than what it actually is. And Berlingos can hold, hold bloody loads. So, that's me packed. We're off on the adventure tomorrow. Hi, this is Citroen Berlingo Micro Camper Van Conversion Part 6. But today, I'm all packed up. I'm going camping. So, the video is going to be my camping video and my setup. So, I'm just going to show you the car loaded up and then I'm going. Right. So, eh? We've got Orion with Jack Russell, all the cars loaded, and here we've got my brother's dog, Zeke, he's 17 years old, he's really frail, he falls over, he can't hold his Wii or his number twos, so it might be his last holiday, so he's a lovely little lad, right anyway, this is a car loaded, right, I'm setting off now. So this is Four Winds campsite. This is my nephew, Robin. He's nearly a month old and it's his first camping holiday. Right, so this is my setup. Dog with the view. You can see all out on the camp field. So it's put a wind block there because he's barking at my kids, aren't ya? <laughs> hey, Chica. So this is a car at night. It's only nine o'clock. But where I'm facing now is out of a window. A little bite light. Morning. It's seven thirty seven in the morning. Stay there. Just made a brew and there's a wood pigeon at the tree at the back there. I've been up for a 45 minutes and decided to make a brew. The little man's awake. Just been for a pedal. You're getting tied up. Don't stay. You've got to stay there. Breakfast time. This mound is a dog. It's got another blankets. But that's now new. He always does it at home. Keeps him warm, eh? And he sat on my knee. Yeah, after your rice lolly. So this is Kyle and Orion. Kyle's my nephew. And he's on holiday with us. Aren't you, Kyle? Say something. Oh, he's not saying, but he's waving hello. So that's good enough. Here's Zeke. Chilling out, 
It's just been really sunny and a bit of clouds come over. Kyle and Zeke. Kyle's Zeke's best friend, aren't you, Kyle? Mm -hmm. Right, Aya, um, I've just found out that the showers on the campsite are cut off now till Tuesday um, and it's Friday today, so um, we're all going to stink. <laughs> I've just made this wind guard and also the dog keeps on trying to climb under there and getting all oil on him, so I've just made it, I've brought these with me, it's modular shelving for like a shoe rack so as you can see i've looked up awning skirts but i'm not paying that price but i do have a fit on a budget i've never shown this before but this is a roof compartment that i have in my citroen berlingo got these, it's got a, inside there is a 12 volt socket, I obviously don't use it when I'm parked up because it'll drain my battery and I ain't got a leisure battery all out and this compartment at the back drops down when you open the boot and it's a huge space it's got a few bags in of storage of stuff I'm not using, that's off the awning and dog towels and bungees but it's a nice big space but because of that I couldn't sit at my back because obviously not enough room headroom so you have to sit further down here so you, my head goes up there Dragonfly. So I've fitted the LED strip lights, the cool white ones. The, the battery compartment is in here, there. So this is it running along. That's a meter. And same on this side. So I'll just put them both on now. Simple to do. There's one, there's the other. I'll show them you tonight. I'm gonna fit the colour one now. <laughs> what are you up to, eh? What are you up to, Chica? What's your tongue doing? Tongue, tongue, good tongue. <laughs> so this LED strip light, the glue on it is rubbish. I've had to duct tape it on. You can see. It keeps falling off. And it's fell off. Fell on my blanket. And got dog hairs on it. So it won't stick now. So I'll have to glue it when I get home. But duct tape saves the day again. So I'm going to do this side. Because look. It's hanging off there. Duct tape bodge up. sunset right so here's one of the LED strip lights as you can see it's really bright put the other one on look how bright that is brighter than my front room So it's sat there, it's ten past nine, and the sun is shining, it's red hot. Both the dogs are sunbathing.
little sun baby. So, this LED strip light, the tape is rubbish. Look at that, only the duct tape's holding it on. Not the tape, the sticky adhesive on the back of it I meant. It's hanging off, so my other brother's got some spray glue and it's high temperature glue that you need to use inside cars apparently. So, this side's the same. Oh well. So, Four Winds Farm campsite and this hill over here, that one, is where we're heading. So, we're heading down this country lane here. There's a country lane there, so not the greatest, but we'll see. Just look at this. We've come off that lane, country lane, and we're on a different one now, but really nice. It's red hot too. It's got to be careful walking on these roads. You're on the side of the oncoming traffic. Well, that's what they tell you for safety. Right, we've ended up on this road here. Right, so the hill's in front of us there and we're heading up that way. I'm not sure whether that's the right way. I don't know where I'm going, just going off instincts and what I can see. Right, I've been walking uphill for about 10 minutes. And we're just at the bottom of the, the mountain. Well, it's not really a mountain, just a big hill. We took a picture of the kids here a couple of years back. Right, so it took 45 minutes, 30 seconds to walk the two mile to the top from the campsite and if you can see uh, look at that for a view let's start off here right here's the trick point come here Ryan 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 what are you doing? Bloody dog. So there's a trick point dog. And he was pulling and messing about. I didn't get to finish a view off. We don't know whether you can see it. That white patch there. That's where I've come from. It's been only me up here for about 20 minutes. Well, I'm a dog. Right, we're heading back down. But I don't know if you can hear this here. There's loads of crickets. There's loads of them. Right, I just decided to run down from the top of the hill and I'm back near the road now. My God, I really crap myself at times. Um, but Greg Far, that was a mad run down. Come here, wait out of the way. Come on, run. This is what it looks like running down a hillside. Whoa, stop, 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 stop. <laughs> Brilliant. Right, I'm back on the road now and it's a road route back home, so I'll catch you up back home. Oh, that. Keep away, Ryan. Look, wow. A dead rabbit, squished. Come on. Oh, horrible. I was going to stop there and have a drink, but keep stopping giving the dog a drink I'm gonna stop here it's just on the left down there awesome I've just got back and my brother's just got back and I've had a pasty from a pound bakery can't beat it go up in hell come back eat a pasty <laughs> So 
so it was one hour 43 minutes 13 seconds it was 3.23 mile and that's the pace get off my chocolate that's mine you just had dindins dindins that's why he's smacking his tongue shut up Francesca big gob the end product a tired dog Niece, Francesca, with how many water balloons? Five. Five, and she's going to get Kyle and Hermione as well. They're going to have a war. Water balloon war. Look at this face. Look at that. Mini Pauline. Mini Pauline. Right, so it's 7.49, um, I've been up from half six, but it's freezing in my car today, there's not much sun, um, the dog is under my coat here, when he woke up he'll be shivering, um, so I've got him on my bed and then um, put the coat over him, it's a mountain coat, so I think he's quite warm now, but yeah, it's really cold today. Right, so all the family are going to walk today, so... Here we go. Right, we're at the beach in, where is it? Really? Prestatin. We just walked across cat farmer's fields full of cow poo. Loads of styles. We've got a pram with us. Nightmare. This way, Orion. There's my niece, the mine is swimming. Orion's biting the waves. This is where we are. There's Sal. that in and rill down there look how quick the sea is coming This is Sal, she's been on holiday with us and she's going home today with my brother, it's Sunday. So, it's 9.26, it's cold night, clear skies. I've got a coat on the dog. My mum made this. It's made out of fleece to keep him warm. But he's just been growling at me because I put it on. He's growled a lot this holiday because he's been tired. And when he's tired, he's a grumpy dog.
Mark Paz. So, the dog's nice and warm this morning in his camo coat. Alright, yeah. Hey. You good boy. Hey. You're looking at the camera. Hey. It's absolutely red hot. My dogs are in the shade. Right, so we're going home today. I've camped six nights. My brother's camped near enough 13 nights, I think. So we've had enough. We're going home one night earlier. Right, so I've had a few fails in my car. If you can see behind me, the side of my head, the LED strip lights dangling down. Also, I was cold at the nights, so either get a thicker sleeping bag and more covers, or somehow get a heater in my car, some sort of heater, so I'll have to look into that. Otherwise, yeah, it's been top, really enjoyed myself, and it's the longest time I've camped six nights, um, for about five years or more, and I've done it in my car, so yeah, I'm buzzing. Also, the bed extension snapped. I leaned on it, getting something off the passenger seat, and it snapped right off, but it was cheap old chipboard, so that needs doing. So, some things that I want to do, I want to get insulation on my windows. I'm in a Facebook group called Small Vehicle Campus, and a woman had made insulation for the windows out of sleeping mats, um, you know, the foam sleeping mats so i'm going to look into that also i need some form of power whether get a solar battery power bank or i don't know because i've used my brother's hookup he's had hookup and i've used that to charge my phones and that but yeah definitely need some sort of power i need to put a better mattress on my bed either get rid of this foam one and buy some reflex foam that i'd seen or get a memory foam topper for this but it's not comfortable enough um you you feel the board underneath it because it's not thick enough or the foam's just not dense enough right so that's me all packed up just gotta get zeke in and then i can drive home Right, this is a proper random video of the car conversion and camping. Right, so you've been watching me, Paul, at One Man One Dog. Right, thanks for watching. So, it's bye from me. It's bye from me. <coughs> thanks for watching and it's goodbye from me. Bye. Bye.